everyone, this is Stacy with Sit Stay with Stacy Slade, and I want to talk a little bit about calling your dog when they're off leash. So the first thing is, is I never use the word come because unless I have a reliable come from my dog, why would I say a word that they don't have any association with what that means? So I would use something like Hazy. Hazy turned around, she came to me and she came back to me. Now, the other part is always having treats in your hand. Always have treats, so my dog knows that when they come, they get a treat. So she can go off and play, she may not, because Hazy absolutely loves food, and she thinks it's time to train. But the idea is, it, is that she can come and go and get rewarded for it, and I don't put her on a leash, which could be seen by a dog as ruining their play. So they can go off and do their thing and go play, and then you call them to come back and you reward them. So it's important to have that relationship with your dog where you can call them, Hazy, I use her name, good girl, and she comes for the food. So it's important that she has that relationship. Their dog's barking over there, but yet she knows that she gets treats when she comes and talks to me, and I'm calling her. So that develops that relationship. I don't say the word come unless I have a leash on her, unless I can reinforce that command to actually come to me. So this is an example. I'm in tons of acreage. Hazy was running over there when I first got on with you guys and I called her, she came running. Now she doesn't want to leave because she knows I have food, which is great and I appreciate that from her, but she's out here playing with all these dogs. There's a ton of dogs here and Figgy Fig! And I'll call Figgy so she knows I have food and she's gonna come running as with other dogs. The girl, hey Thistle. So we've got a couple dogs here and I'm gonna reward that. I just used their name, I didn't use come. So good girl. So I just, so that's rewarded from them that to come when I call their name. Hi girls, good dogs. So I, I don't put a leash on them, I don't grab their collar to go. I'm just reinstituting that when I call your name to come to me. I use the word come when I'm on a leash or I'm in the ring for obedience or rally and I can reinforce that because if I tell Hazy to come and she doesn't come, then that word and that command loses its value because nothing happened. She didn't get rewarded for it. She ignored it. So it's going to mean less and less each time. So that's something that you want to keep in mind so you don't devalue the, the, the command. The worst thing you can do is get mad at them when you finally do get them. If you're out there, Roscoe, come, Roscoe, come, Roscoe, come, and you finally get them and you're mad at them, they will never want to come to you again. Hazy, good girl. So I called her, she comes running, I, she gets a treat, she gets loves, and then I said, go play. So I'm reinforcing the go play, go have a good time. But I just wanted to show you guys a little bit about how I work with my dog in an off-leash situation. I'm at a friend's home, I'm not at a dog park. Very safe environment with dogs and friends I know um, and that my dog can play with and socialize with, which is important because she's a puppy to meet and play with other dogs. So work on your getting your dog to come to you with using their name, reinforcing it with yummy treats. Always have yummy treats with you whenever you travel with your dog and make sure it's positive and fun and then eventually when I call her and put the leash on, it will be no different from the other times I've called her. Hazy! Yeah, good girl. Happy training!